contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, from Death Valley, weighing in at 305 pounds, The Undertaker. and I'm Michael Cole here at ringside welcoming you to Minneapolis, Minnesota. Hey, I got top billing tonight. I'll pay you later. Well, what can I say? These Minneapolis fans have got me in such a great mood. I'm feeling especially generous tonight. He was one step ahead on that one. Well, it looks like they're slowing the pace down a little bit here. That might not be such a good move in my opinion. Well, come on. You just can't keep going non-stop. That's a good way to wear yourself out and make a critical mistake. No, but you can't give the opponent any time to recover, neither. You gotta stay on him and wear him down. But what about picking your spot? If you try to execute a badly timed move just because you want to stay on offense, that could have a disastrous result. I'll tell you what, bro. Let me talk about what it's like to be in a match like this, and you can cover what it's like to whiten your teeth. Gil! You feel like a real jerk when somebody counters you like that. If I had to pick only one reason why I'm not on Raw, it would have to be Kane. Just being this close to this monster is terrifying. I couldn't imagine having to do it every week. Hey Cole, change your underpants and settle down, okay? Me, I like watching Kane tear dudes apart. That's just me. I can watch the Big Red Machine every day of the week. I like this guy, maybe even twice on Sundays. But the viciousness, the brutality, the complete lack of concern. It looks like he's decided to finish off his opponent. And what a way to do it. A tombstone. You know, I know I say this a lot, Cole. But this is not ballet. You step between those ropes, you better be prepared to take some punishment. And to dish some out as well. I don't think I've ever seen a superstar win a match by being a tackling dummy. It's obvious these superstars have studied each other real carefully. No question about that, Taz. You won't last long against an opponent you haven't done your homework on. Can you believe this 
match so far, Cole? I really can't, Taz. This isn't anything like what I expected from these competitors. Yeah, I gotta admit, they're surprising the hell out of me here, too. And I think it's that unpredictability that makes these superstars so exciting to watch. I don't think the fans like that one too much. <laughs> I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE, and he doesn't give a damn what they think. That was a textbook reversal. You know, the key is the reversal call. We've seen an excellent match so far, and it's not over yet. Not by a long shot, Cole. And that's a good thing. I don't think we could ever get sick of watching these superstars go at it. Me neither, partner. This one's got rematch written all over it. You know, you can't take a beating like this and expect to win the match, Cole. I don't think this is going to last much longer. I think this proves without a doubt why SmackDown's the dominant brand in sports entertainment. I can't help but agree, partner. You won't see action like this on Raw. Yeah, and even if you did, you'd have to listen to a couple of yahoos jabbering uh, about puppies and, and government mules and uh, scolded dogs. I, I tell you, it's like a damn zoo over there. No doubt from what we're seeing here, these WWE fans are getting their money's worth. If they don't yet, I'm sure they will by the end of the match, Taz. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? What the? Th that's his opponent finishing maneuver. This is just dumb, Cole. You don't win a match by taunting your opponent to death. I disagree, Taz. Getting the crowd on your side can be a huge psychological boost. He's bleeding all over the place. This one's getting ugly. It's definitely not pretty, but it's definitely effective, Cole. Look, here's the deal. You make your opponent bleed, and you got the psychological edge over him. Case closed. Maybe so, but I'm more concerned about the risk to his physical well-being now that he's been busted open. I'll tell you, as long as these superstars have got anything left in the tank, they'll just keep going. They certainly don't look like they're going to give anything less than 100% here tonight. That reversal might stop his opponent's momentum dead. Thingy, look at this. Could it be? The dead... Oh my god, what a brutal match! And the loser has paid the ultimate price. Here's your winner! That's a hell of a lot worse the than The Undertaker! It's worse than anything I can imagine. But both superstars knew the risks going in. Welcome to a sold-out show for Phoenix, Arizona. I'm Michael Cole, here with Taz at ringside, and have we got a show for you tonight. Hey, Cole, we're in the desert. This is nuts. Every SmackDown show is bigger and better than the ones that came before, and tonight's going to be bigger than all of them. That's a bold statement, partner, but I can't disagree. I don't think Phoenix has any idea what they're in for tonight. This isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. You're not going to hear me say this much, Cole, but I definitely agree with you. This has all the makings of a nice, long feud. 
I don't know how nice it is, but there are certainly some issues between these superstars, and I think this match might only exasperate them. Jeez, Cole, watch your language. Look at him go, Cole. I'll explain why this is so exciting when you get a little bit older. Looks like we're getting a little lingerie show here tonight. You never know what to expect from these... Man, she's not going easy on her, Cole. So, Cole, you got any predictions? Uh, you know who you think's gonna win this one? No way. I've seen you embarrass yourself with enough bad guesses that I'm not going to risk doing the same. I think we know which way this one's gonna go, Cole. Actually, Taz, from my perspective, I think it could go either way. And what perspective would that be exactly? The perspective of somebody who has a neck that resembles a stack of dimes? Oh my, this could be the match right here. This one's gonna keep on going until someone can't go anymore. And considering the conditioning of these athletes, that could be quite a while from now. You gotta love two girls sharing a pillow. Not for nothing, this is not exactly what I had in mind. I don't believe it. I think Taz is actually speechless. You know, I know I say this a lot, Cole, but this is not ballet. You step between those ropes, you better be prepared to take some punishment. And to dish some out as well. I don't think I've ever seen... This is my kind of match, Cole. Too bad it might be over. Talk about some unconventional offense. Man, Cole, I don't want this. It's coming off, Cole. This is it. Wow. I bet you didn't count on showing that much skin here tonight. Look at her go. She's smacking the hell out of him. Man, I don't envy that ref. You know, the last place I'd want to be is between these superstars. You can say that again. Talk about hazardous to your health. <laughs> Looks like someone... What a match! I got goosebumps! That wasn't what I would call the most athletic match I've ever seen, but I'll tell you, here's your winner. winner! I hope not, Taz, or I have Trish. to start wondering Stratus. about it. You worrying about me? That's a good one. You're a funny guy, but then again, looks on everything. This is a Sables, Ladders, and Chairs match. On the way to the ring, from San Antonio, Texas, weighing in at 225 pounds, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michael. I'm not your boy, toy. I'm just a sexy boy. Calgary, Alberta, 
Canada, weighing 234 pounds, Brett Pittman Hart. Gentlemen, welcome to a sold-out show here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. I'm Michael Cole here with Taz at Ringside. Man, you couldn't fit another fan in here with a crowbar, I'm telling you. There's a whole lot of cheese heads in the house tonight. It sure is. Green Bay knows that they're about to see the greatest superstars in all of sports entertainment. I can't wait to get started. one's just turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was gonna be intense. We knew it was gonna be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I got a hit kind of beat by surprise, Cole. And that don't happen too often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty good idea of what to expect, but not this time. I guess it just goes to show you, Cole, like they say, anything can happen here in WWE. He's really going to town on this guy with that ladder, Cole. I gotta say, Cole, when I first heard about this match, I wasn't sure what to think. But these superstars are blowing me away right here. Really? As soon as I heard about it, I expected a tremendous matchup. And I haven't been disappointed. Well, I wouldn't say I'm not disappointed. But I'll talk about getting stuck with you as a broadcast partner. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that another time. Michaels is... Wow! What a shot from that ladder! This is one heck of a match so far. It sure is, Taz. What do you think the highlight has been so far? Well, that'll probably come a little bit later on in the match, when you decide to shut your yap for a few seconds, and I can uh, enjoy it in peace. Well, excuse me for doing my job, partner. Sorry to have disturbed you. What an incredible match we've seen so far. And it ain't over yet, Cole. It sure isn't. I think these superstars could keep going for quite a while longer. He saw that one coming. Night after night, the WWE superstars never fail to amaze the fans. And that's a good thing, Cole. I don't ever want to think about where we'd be if they didn't. Well, we wouldn't be sitting here calling this match, that's for sure. This is not just a match anymore, Cole. These superstars have got a legitimate beef with each other. They do indeed. There's a lot of bad blood here for sure. And if this keeps up much longer, that bad blood's gonna wind up all over the place. I certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. No matter what call you make, you're gonna get on the bad side of at least one superstar. And that's about the last place you wanna be if you're not a superstar yourself. Trust me, I know. Wow, he drilled this dude right through the table. You feel like a real jerk when somebody counted you like that.
It's not easy maintaining this type of intensity week after week after week, Cole. Trust me. I don't doubt it, Taz. The WWE superstars don't get an offseason. They compete every week until they're not physically... Oh, my God. They're tearing each other apart up there. Man, there's not an ounce of quit in these superstars. This is not a fight that either superstar can afford to lose. Hey, the ref's got a tough job. I mean, trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. Well, it's easier to get some superstars to play by the rules than others. Hey, you know what, Cole? If you're gonna get on your high horse again and give us another lecture about playing fast, well, if they didn't want him using the chair like that, they shouldn't have left it lying around. This one could still go either way, Cole. It sure could. It's not over until the referee calls for the bell. He's taking a little time to give his opponent a piece of his mind. You sure he can spare it, Cole? I'll tell you, anyone who thinks this business is a piece of cake, they should get in the ring with these superstars. I don't think anyone would last too long against them. These are trained WWE professionals. I gotta tell you, Cole, I thought I had this thing figured out. But now I got no idea how this is gonna end up. Neither do I, Taz. And I think it's that unpredictability that makes it so exciting. No doubt, Cole. I've seen superstars get a huge advantage over their opponents and still lose the match because they got sloppy. Anything can happen in WWE. An entire match can turn on one or two big moves. And that's why you can't take your eyes off the action for one second. You never know when something huge is going to go down. There's the reversal, Cole. Whoa! He's using that left like a battering ram. He anticipated that move perfectly. The conditions are right for a finishing move. are clearly giving it their all tonight. Not a surprise. His
Standing seven feet tall, weighing 493 pounds, The Big Show! show from Phoenix, Arizona. I'm Michael Cole, here with Taz at ringside, and have we got a show for you tonight. Hey, Paul, we're in the desert. This is nuts. Every SmackDown show is bigger and better than the ones that came before, and tonight's gonna be bigger than all. That's a bold statement, partner, but I can't disagree. I don't think Phoenix has any idea what they're in for tonight. Look at these fans. They didn't like that one bit. Yeah, well, you know what? I got some bad news for these fans. He don't give a damn what you think. Man, this crowd is really swelling this guy's head. There's no doubt that these fans love him, Taz, and he's feeding off that energy right now. Ladies and gentlemen, we are seeing an incredible display of athletic ability here tonight. What do you expect, Cole? These are WWE superstars for crying out loud. They're the greatest athletes in the world. True enough, Taz. There's no off-season for them. There's no month or two off between matches. There sure ain't, Cole. I mean, these guys are here week in and week out, and every night they get in the ring. And they do it all for the WWE fans, Taz. Without them, none of us would even be here. like this makes me proud to be part of this company. I'm with you, partner. You just can't experience a thrill like this anywhere else. And that's because you ain't gonna see athletes like this anywhere else. You certainly are. I th Superstars certainly aren't going easy on each other tonight. They sure are giving the fans their money's worth. No doubt, Cole. These WWE superstars put their bodies on the line night after night. And the fans sell out these arenas night after night, Taz. It sounds like a pretty fair trade to me. I'm not sure if everyone's going to be happy about it, but... What a battle. Here's your and there's winner. no doubt in anyone's mind who won that one. Andre yeah, when you're still the standing, giant. And the guy you were just in there with can't. It's pretty clear who the winner is. It sure is. If you want to see a physically dominating superstar.
One.
Here's your winner, Mankind! This is good old JR Jim Ross here with Jerry the King Lawler. I've never seen a crowd so fired up, JR. They can't wait to get started, and neither can I. That makes two of us, King. I don't think Portland's gonna know what hit it after tonight. A reversal. Can he capitalize on it? about ruthless aggression. Look at the way these superstars have been going after each other. They're not playing with kid gloves, that's for sure. We knew we were gonna see a heck of a match, but this might turn out to be... No. Go ahead and say it, JR. All right, I will. I think this one's got all the makings of a bona fide slobber knocker. He's got his opponent locked into submission, JR. This could be it. It could indeed. He might force his opponent to tap out right here. I think I know who's gonna win this match, but I don't want to say. I'm afraid I'll jinx it. Come on, King. Don't tell me you're superstitious. Of course not, JR. I'm not superstitious because I know that's unlucky. He went straight for the pin. Oh. No flies on him. This match is going to continue until someone's completely rehabilitated. And considering the resiliency of these superstars, that's not going to be easy. That's for sure. No one in this match is going down without a fight. And I wouldn't expect any less from the King. Like them or not, you've got to respect the tenacity of each and every WWE superstar. The intensity of these superstars is unbelievable. No doubt about that, King. The fans are getting their money's worth here tonight. And there's a little something for the crowd. The best superstars never ignore their fans. The best superstars also finish off their opponents instead of giving them time to recover. I 
this one's going to turn out, JR. Honestly, King, I have absolutely no idea. Anything can happen here in the WWE. But you've got to have a guess, right? I might, but I'd rather keep it to myself. Is this all the same to you, King? Oh, no. You know what's coming. Can you imagine having to tell one of these superstars no? Boy, I think I've had nightmares about trying to do something. Look at this! Here it comes! The rock bottom! Nobody gets up from that, JR! Looks like things have quieted down here a bit, JR. Well, you can be certain that won't last long, King. That's for sure. I haven't seen the superstar yet who goes down without a fight. There's the pin! One, two, three. It's over. Chalk up another win. I've pinned a lot of superstars in my day, JR, and it's tougher than it looks. No question about that. Here's your winner and he the had the new WWE champion. And tonight, he was the better man. The but I wonder Rock. what would happen in a rematch.
Brown's going to bring down the house in Salt Lake City, Utah. I'm Michael Cole here with Taz at Ringside. You got that right, Cole. I'll tell you what, man. I am so pumped up and amped up. I can't wait. Neither can I, Taz. And I'm sure these Salt Lake fans can't either. So let's get this show on the road. These superstars have proven time and again that they're willing and able to go the distance. Well, you don't go too far in this business if you're not. He saw that one coming. Triple H is the man, Cole. I've been in the ring with this dude, and I'm not ashamed to say he took me to limits, and he got the victory. I've got a lot of respect for anyone who can pull that one off. Wait a second. You're telling me that your entire opinion of the man is based on the fact that he beat you in a... I feel like a real jerk when somebody counts you like that. I don't think the fans like that one too much. I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE. And he doesn't give a damn what they think. You know, a lot of guys call themselves the best in the business. But in Triple H's case, I think he's right on. Man, I'll tell you, I'd love to have him on SmackDown. You've got to be kidding me, Taz. Triple H has systematically destroyed the Raw roster. He might be the most hated superstar of all time. Yeah, but don't kid yourself, Cole. The fans tune in every week to... Look out! Here it comes! Stunner! He could take a dude's head right off with that one. Man, I almost feel bad for JR and King, Cole. When's the last time you think they saw a match this good? I couldn't tell you, Taz. I don't know if they've ever had anything this good. Oh, no! He's using the title as a weapon! Man, even if you end up winning a match like this, you're gonna be feeling it for the next week. Yes, but that's the case if you lose as well. And having to deal with emotional as well as physical pain is that much worse. Emotional? What the hell are you talking about? Well, I've been in the locker room after a match and seen the superstars who don't get their hands raised. You can literally feel the disappointment radiating off them. It's not a pretty sight. He anticipated that move perfectly. Might be in for a finisher here, Cole. Oh. Cold stunner. That seal a deal right here, Cole. One, two, three. I've been looking forward four, to this match all night long, Cole. Five, so have I. It's certainly been six, one of the most anticipated matchups seven, in recent weeks. And usually eight, when you have that kind of hype, it's nine, really tough to live up to the expectations. But these superstars ain't having any trouble doing that. They sure aren't. And that's an impressive thing in and of itself. I think the SmackDown locker room is extremely grateful that Triple H is not a part of it. Then the Smack... Look at these fans. They didn't like that one bit. Yeah, well, you know what? I got some bad news for these fans. He don't give a damn what you think. He dodged that bullet. Oh, man. You know what this is, Cole? I sure do. The Stone Cold Stunner delivered with lethal precision. One. And here's a little Two, something for the fans. That's why three, they love him. You know what? But who four, cares what they think? All five, he's doing here is giving his opponent a chance six, to recover. Seven. It's so great seeing these athletes compete here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't tell you 
How glad I am that it did. Here it goes. Show off for the crowd all you want. Three, all that does is let your opponent rest up. Four, Actually, Taz, I think it's five, a great display of confidence on the part six, of this great superstar. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. The match is over. That's all she wrote. Holy great match, Cole. Talk about a rocket buster. You're not kidding, Taz. Here's These your superstars winner beat the hell out of each other. Until one of them can no longer stay. Then I'll tell you. These great WWE fans Stone definitely Cold got their money's worth. Steve Austin!